things to think about now for the future, definitely. Well, let's get a check on our weather now. And heading out, it looks pretty gray outside. How's, how's that going to affect people it heading does. out? It does. I mean, despite the fact that the sun is officially up, we are still mm -hmm. dealing with that May it doesn't gray look setup. Up. It doesn't look like it. And I mean, we're about to head into June gloom, and I'm sure this is going to look very similar to our forecast tomorrow morning. Let's take a look, actually, so we could time this out. That onshore flow is staying pretty consistent right now, just at the Golden Gate Bridge. Official sunrise was about 30 minutes ago, and yeah, it's still gloomy out there despite that. Now, here's what we're looking at for our daytime highs today. Still below average. We're in the low 70s, or actually mid 70s near our inland areas. Cooler conditions along the coast in the bay with upper 50s and lower 60s this afternoon. We will see some sunshine, and here's the good news. Despite the fact that we're below average, we're about to head into meteorological summer starting tomorrow into that June, July, August summer month. And to be honest with you, our temperature is going to jump a lot within just the next couple days. So this kind of aligns perfectly with this high pressure system that's moving its way in. This is going to dry us up and warm us up as we head into our weekend forecast. As we're thinking ahead, Saturday, Sunday, what are our plans? Well, I know we just came out of a long weekend, but if you are a forward thinker, well, we have beautiful weather in store for us. Daytime highs today alone are still kind of cool. I mean, go over close to Livermore, which is in the upper 70s. We're supposed to be around 78 during this time of year, so that's fine. But once we head into this weekend, we're going to warm up just a hair more all throughout the Bay Area, meaning sunny skies and temperatures just a bit above average. That leaves us in the low 80s, upper 70s if you plan on heading up to wine country this weekend. Let's take a look at some of the other microclimates here locally because no matter where you live, you're going to feel that bit of a warm up and it will feel drier too. I mean, just along San Francisco alone, sunny skies and upper 60s expected for our Saturday trend. Today alone, it's still mild, even for our friends in our inland East Bay. Like I mentioned, 78 this afternoon, 57 along the coast. Notice that jump. It's not that significant for our coastline. We're only going to hit the low 60s as early as Saturday going into Sunday. And for our friends up in the North Bay, Beautiful today. I mean, light winds for the most part. That onshore flow impacts a lot more of our coastlines and into the heart of San Francisco. But for the rest of us, light winds, daytime highs still sitting in the upper 70s by Friday, low 80s once we head into Saturday. Gianna, how are the roads this morning?